This trap once more, and I'll feed him to the crocodile. Got it. Such a can't, you great dolt. Now, how are we doing for time? Um, uh, let's see, uh, soap, toothbrush, wallet, alarm clock, uh, ouch. Ouch! Ow! to call Radleone. Peace. But boss, the crocodile ain't it. Great. Now what do we do? Mm, uh, we could, uh, <clears throat> we could, uh, have Mr. Radleone pay for the call. Okay, then. You do it. Oh, Come here. Ah! The boss <laughs> hates that. Yeah. What? What? You want me to pay for the call? What do they take me for, a millionaire? Okay, well, we'll say something then. This is already costing me. Is that you, Bonehead? Oh, no, no. Uh, it's the other Bonehead. Mission accomplished? Really? Huh? Are you sure? No problems? The Oryx is really in the truck? Good, 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 perfect. What? No! I repeat, 
it's not infectious for rats. <laughs> it's only infectious for another organism. Send them off to Arabia as planned. <laughs> I'll do you a special price. How much? Hold it. You're fatting up already. She's always late. Not only do they make us wait, but they send us to these impossible places and leave us to starve to death. One cake? That's less calories than a, a Turkish delight. A new oil field delight, has just been it? discovered in the Nafood Desert. This means after long years of research, Ratko has its hands on what could be called a black gold mine. All is not as simple as it seems, though. Mr. Ratlioni, the director of Ratko, welcomed us into his home where he answered some of our questions. Your company has just discovered an important oil field. Do you think you'll get permission to drill there, even though it is a reserve for protected animals? Yes, we are the best everywhere, despite the pollution taxes heaped upon us, thought up by bureaucratic ecologists who want to ruin industry. <laughs> <laughs> so we would be right in saying that you have a hard job getting permission to drill in the Nafood oil field. <laughs> yes, while I could be giving work to those poor people who need it, they prefer to sacrifice the unemployed for some... Some, uh, Oryx. some, uh, <laughs> yeah, Oryx. as you say, and who would be much better off in a circus. Uh, mm. uh, Mr. Ratlioni, isn't the survival of the <laughs> species important? <coughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I wonder if us being here hasn't got something to do with this oil field. I'd say there's something in the wind. How clever of you. With Rattle only, it's bound to be Hello, an ill win. Everybody. <laughs> only two hours late. They won't let me eat any <laughs> Turkish delights. <laughs> so I, I, what does Know How want us to do? Uh, good day, Mom. Could I offer you a little Turkish delight at half price? Have you got a cold, know-how? Uh, an experiment that didn't go too well. I wanted to observe fish, but I'm afraid I observed uh, a little too closely. <laughs> uh, is that you, Bamboo Lee? Don't you recognize me? Alas, my dear Bamboo Lee, I lost my glasses. I have some very important information to pass on to you. You are probably wondering why I've sent you to the Nefo Desert. Does it have anything to do with the oil that Rat Leone's found? Nah, now I recognize you well, my dear Bambouli. Your perspicacity always amazes me. <laughs> Nothing but praise. All Rat Leone needs to get his permission is for the Oryx to disappear. He can hardly shoot them all. That would make too much fuss in the newspapers, for one thing. Now, a strange event has been brought to my attention, which occurred in a zoo recently. An Oryx was stolen. This Oryx was in quarantine because he had a disease called blue tongue. Well, who would want to kidnap a sick animal? One more fact, no less strange, caught the attention of the zoo manager. The poor beast ended up by coughing up a well-used bar of soap, an alarm clock, a toothbrush, and this. Well, they really are dumb, leaving their signature like that. So, young man, your diagnosis. Well, if they manage to bring this sick oryx back to its habitat, the epidemic will spread through the whole species with no way of stopping it. And that'll be the end of the oryx. And the start of a new fortune for Rat Leone. Right, now we can call the boss. Yeah, and ask him to pay for it. Huh, I bet it's a mirage. You know, mm, mirage. Yeah, thing. okay. All right, how much you want to bet, huh? Well, I bet you $2.23 and your toothbrush. Mm. You're on. Here yeah, yeah. goes. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you owe me $2.23 and my toothbrush. It's the 
Oryx Reserve. What do they eat, these animals? The same thing as goats. Phew. Whoa! You don't have to go so fast. Look, you're scaring the Oryx. What are you supposed to be now, a sea serpent? Wow, a lake in the desert. Ooh, that's strange. It's an artificial lake. Who are you, strangers? Friends, we've come to protect you. Do we need protecting? Listen carefully to what I've got to say, and you'll understand. So, we should not go to meet our brother? You must not. The consequences would be terrible. It was he who was kidnapped two years ago, him who I loved. Now he returns and slips away from me once again. Oh, rage. Oh, despair. Oh, the wickedness of the rat who in his great violence robs me of the one I love. I understand how you feel, but for our own safety and yours, you must not go to him. Disaster. Darlene, what is it? Is the sky falling in or something? Almost. Our lovelorn Oryx has gone off to join her beloved. Great! Huh? huh? Well, shall we go and look for her? No point. Let's find the rats in that sick Oryx before she does. It's the little one on guard. He's not dangerous. Pass me the binoculars. With that gun he's got in his hands, I wouldn't risk it. I don't think he knows how to use it. I wouldn't be too sure. We're gonna have to be very careful. Hey guys, I can see another mirage. There he goes again. Yeah, but it ain't like the others. Since it's only a mirage, you just have to put your foot down. Hold it. I bet you she's real. Listen, double a quick. One dollar, twelve cents, and four toothbrushes. It's a bet! You're not a mirage! No, I am afraid not. Greetings, comrades. I am Dr. Ratovisky from the University of Ratislava. I was parachuted in last night by a Ratko. My mission to watch over the health of the Oryx. It would be most unfortunate if the subject died before rejoining his family, and it would ruin the organization's plans. The guilty ones will be punished. Yeah, I wasn't told you were coming. Given your past performances, Mr. Ratlioni thought it was wise to take extra precautions to limit the possibilities of failure. Uh, it seems you're the boss, Doc. So, take me to the patient, yeah? You needn't stay. I wish to be alone with my patient. I'm afraid I got some bad news for you. I know, Doctor. I'm very ill. I knew already at the zoo, but I will do anything to see my beloved one last time. But you can't. Oh, you poor thing. You'll condemn her with no chance of escape. Your disease is contagious. And Ratko wants you to pass it on to the whole of your species and wipe them out. More sugar, Doctor? Never take sugar. It is very bad for health. Very bad for the health. <laughs> One lump or two? Or three or four? Oh, well, better make sure. Why'd you have to grab at it? Oh, so now it's all my fault again. That's enough. Come back and stick it together again. What are you up to, Bonehead? What? I don't know. What's boss? up with the car? It's, it's smoking. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to finish the Oryx off with this smoke. Help me to undo the cage. Hey. 
You're gonna fix this useless engine right now? Yes, boss. Everything seems normal. It must be something underneath. That's for sure. Go and look, then. But, uh... Three, just do it. <sighs> I didn't want that to happen. Well, well, it had to come to this one day. You think he's hurt? Blown to bits, in little pieces, oh. mince rat roasted in diesel. And to think I still owed him one dollar, twelve cents, and four toothbrushes. <laughs> a mirage. Double or quit. 71 cents, eight toothbrushes, and number one's tweezers, two or false. It's a bet. You lose. Come on, pay up. Your bet is in danger, okay? I'm not sure which pocket it's in anyway. We can discuss this later. Let's get out of here. Darlene and the little rat are getting the big one who fell over the precipice back. They've lost their jeep. Good heavens. Their boss is about to play a dirty trick. He's playing his last card. He's sending the Oryx back to the reserve. We've no time to lose. We must get Darlene back. Another mirage. I wouldn't bet on it. You see, one, mirages don't carry people off like that. Yeah, I knew there was something fishy about Comrade Doctor. She's going back to Ratleone. Shut up, Bonehead, or I'll send you to join your ancestors. Hey, oh. Stop him! Shall I set fire to the desert? No! There's another way! You know what you're risking? Don't do it! Stop. I am sick. I don't want to infect you. Thanks for understanding! So... I have to go back to the zoo then? To die far from my family? Well, maybe. We must get in touch with know-how and ask his advice. I knew you were going to call me. Have you been able to stop the rats? Mission accomplished, but can we heal the sick orc so he can go home? Oh, indeed, there is a possibility. Uh, now, where is that cursed address? Ah, there we are. Ah, a healer. He's a hermit, he lives in a cave, he has formulas he's inherited from the ancient doctors of Baghdad. He isn't too far from where you are now. Sir, are you Nabokadonazer? Perhaps. And you? Who are you? Who are you, strangers who have come to disturb my tranquility? Oh, noble one, on the advice of Know How, we come to employ you to share with us some of your knowledge. Know How? How is that old scoundrel? He's watching over the well being of rat kind. How can I help you? Do you really think he's going to succeed? I hope so. I really hope so.
It's not the first time it's got fire. In fact, it's a good sign. We have to take care. It's toad juice mixed with concentrate. There's enough to cure the oryx. Ask him to drink this. He's cured. It's a beautiful thing, love. Bye. 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 Shut up. I'll feed him to the ants. Tyrant. That will appear in my report. Look. A new mirage. $88.176 and one toothbrush. It's a bet. What the? Oh, what has he done to you, my poor machine? Calm down. We work for Raglione. Do you want to argue? Come in, gentlemen, and take some refreshment. Mr. Raglione was most keen to come and give us his point of view. Sir, are you disappointed not to have permission to drill as you expected? Unhappily, civilization is going downhill. Animals seem to be more important than rat kind. It's scandalous. It's all very suspicious, too. My thoughts go out to all those poor, unemployed rats which this terrible injustice has left without hope. And in particular, those newly unemployed who will be coming back across the Nepro Desert on foot. Yes! Three numbskulls! Oh, too well. Three cretins, three hockey playing, I don't like it, squeaking, moaning, 